Well, the second Saturday of each month, the Crossing Arts Alliance gives away free creativity art kits to promote local art in the area. Being a nonprofit, that means they need to come up with creative ways to be able to afford that. Enter the 8x8 Art Show. Chris Burns and 120 others put brush to canvas in tonight's In Focus. I think that there's a piece for everybody in here. It's just a nice size. The canvases are 8 inches by 8 inches. You can hang them pretty much anywhere in your home, set them on a shelf, and think about the community member that donated it. It's the sixth year of the 8x8 Art Show. The Crossing Arts Alliance gives out canvases to anyone wishing to participate. The artist is tasked with creating whatever they want on the canvas and entering it in an auction. We put these pieces on display so that people can look at them and then they can bid online. And the proceeds from our auction go to benefit our creativity kit program. Being it my first time attempting a painting, I stuck with the more traditional paint on canvas. But some artists took this opportunity to showcase their artistic ability to transform the canvas into something much more. Well, I love that. It's a blank canvas, but everybody comes to it with a different idea. Some of those canvases have been physically turned around and artists have made work on the back of the canvas. Others have painted, some have sewn. Um, it's, it's really a nice smattering of different mediums. Every year, 100% of the proceeds go to their creativity art kits. But this year, Jordan decided to offer 50% of the painting's auction price back to the artist. We recognize that the past two years have been really difficult with the pandemic, and especially those who are in the creative arts. So we wanted to give them an opportunity to retain some of the funds. Following the auction is incredibly easy. For people visiting the store, one just finds a piece they want to place a bid on, takes their phone out, scans the QR code, and a link will take you to the web page the auction is on. People not visiting the store can still participate. They can visit crossingarts.org and the link for the auction, the online auction, is right on our front page. They, the auction closes at midnight on the 17th. Reporting in Brainerd for this week's In Focus, Chris Burns, Lakeland News. The Crossing Arts Alliance is located in Brainerd, but they mentioned don't let that stop you from bidding. They'll ship the canvas anywhere in the U.S. Lakeland News is member-supported content. Please consider supporting Lakeland News today.